Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and a lot of you have been asking when's the bug fixes, when's the bug fixes in Windows 11. Well, they are released today at the same time as the Windows 10 bug fixes. Uh, usually there's a difference in the day or what week, but this week all of uh, the bug fixes are on the same day. So Windows 11 is getting its uh, first 2022 bug fixing update. If you have no issues on Windows 11, if everything's all right, you don't have to do anything about it. But if you do have issues, this fixes a very big list of problems. So just head on to your settings and into Windows Update. And the reason why, this is an optional update. So you got to check for updates because they don't show up if you don't because it's an optional download and install. So today we have cumulative update KB5008353 for Windows 11 and there's also an update for the .NET Framework 3.5 and 4.8 for Windows 11. So um, this is of course something that was released to insiders last week and uh, we knew that it was coming within the next um, you know couple of weeks. I'd I actually made a video about it, told you that it would come in the next 10 days, roughly. So here we are. It's official. So some people, are, of course, are um, complaining of issues and things that are not right in Windows 10. So this is, of course, the bug fixing update that goes with it. So if you do have something that's not right, do uh, the update. And what I mean by not right, it's not, it's not working the way you like. Not right is it's just uh, buggy or, you know, there's really some big issue with it. So 22,000.469 is the number for the build of Windows 11 now. And this is, of course, the bug fixing update that's coming to all the insiders. Um, it, of course, has a lot of things to um, fix if you have issues. So check it out and like I said it's optional so that means if you don't go and check for it you won't see it actually so this is the uh, update for the month of January um, you know we'll have one of these every month uh, this year this is the way it works we have one update which is the update for security the patch Tuesday updates we have an update for bug fixes which is optional and uh, that's a little later in the month this is what we're having right now so check it out if you have issues if you don't you know what leave it alone uh, it will install anyways because it will install with the patch Tuesday updates if you don't install it now but you know why you know if it ain't broke don't fix it is really really something that is uh, my motto for um, Windows and um, without security updates because there's really no security updates in here if everything's all right with you, just leave it alone. So um, I know that a lot of you are waiting for this. So it seems that some people are having issues and little problems. We'll be looking a little more into details of this tomorrow uh, as I'll do other videos because I'm going to go through the list of bug fixes and what is, for me, the important fixes that most people are actually complaining about. So uh, check it out if you have issues. And if you don't, just leave it alone. So the Windows 11 bug fixing updates are here and the .NET framework updates are here too. Just uh, go and check out Windows updates. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.